Now we start our seminar. And the first part will be devoted to um, Bernoulli and Riccati equations. We will exercise with equations of this type. And next uh, we may discuss uh, the other types um, studied before. I mean exact differential equations, finding um, integrating factors, linear equations or homogeneous equations, or you may ask some questions concerned with homework, right, if you want, if you need. Mm -hmm. Well, Let's try to solve Bernoulli and Riccati uh, differential equations. Oh, okay, so chalk. Uh -huh. uh, so task number one. Solve them differential equation y prime plus y over x um, equals y squared. Mm -hmm. Okay, who wants to solve? Cafe or follow, welcome. Can I bring my book? Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. It is a Bernoulli equation, so we need to. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just divide by y squared and make a substitution, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, and we can see that the first term. Is, uh, is the derivative of the second one, of 1 over y, right? So this is a hint, almost a derivative, except for the sign, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. That will be, so the new variable will be, uh, no, 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 so it, it should be, uh, it should not mm -hmm, contain the derivative, 1 over y, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you need not remind the form. Uh, so remember the formula, right? Z equals y raised to the power one minus n. Maybe it's difficult, but uh, the idea is to divide by y to n and to look at the first two terms, and we should um, guess them. So we should <laughs> take the substitution uh, so that. Um, the derivative, uh, uh, so the first term um, uh, be the derivative of the second one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, know what y over z, so multiplied by z. Mm -hmm. And let's, let's fix the, the steps. So this is the first step. Just divide by y squared. This is this was the first step. Next, um, we um, chosen the we have chosen the substitution, right? This is the derivative. Next, substitute this, and this is the linear equation. So this will be the second step. Look at this equation; it's linear. Mm -hmm. So the first step is to go from the Bernoulli equation to the linear equation, right? And next, solve this linear equation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. well, mm -hmm. Y minus. Mi ah, minus, mm -hmm, I see, minus, mm -hmm, right, uh, it's correct, minus 1 over x, mm -hmm. not y, but z, mm -hmm. Mm 
Aha. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Minus one, right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. And then Z will be Mm-hmm. This is one of my right. Mm -hmm. Plus C and Y equals huh? okay. Is it a general solution or not? Are there any particular solutions here? Particular solutions. Y equals zero, right? Because we have divided, mm -hmm. we have divided by y squared, and so we have lost a solution y equals zero. So we should add it here. So comma y equals zero. Mm -hmm. So this is a general solution, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's correct. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the next will be mm -hmm. task number two will be this y prime plus um, y hot x equals y to 4 sine x. Mm -hmm. Okay, <laughs> so <coughs> too difficult. I don't like your demo. All right, I see. I will help you. Mm -hmm. So the first step is to reduce this equation to the linear equation. It can be done by dividing by y to 4, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Negative 3. Negative 3. Uh -huh. Sine x, right? Mm -hmm. And so uh -huh, that should be equal to... Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll need to multiply by... Mi minus one-third. You, you may use the coefficient. So minus one-third times, uh, times Z prime. So the first... Mm, so this term is equal to minus. Oh, oh. Uh, uh huh. I recommend you to use this minus one third times z okay. prime, right? So this coefficient should be moved to z prime. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Uh, so I think uh, you should uh, multiply by m minus 3, right? Yes. Multiply and then choose the integrating factor because uh, now it can be so not correct. So let's... <laughs> just a moment. Let's leave it in this form. But let's... Uh, the, next, the next row... I will remove this. Mm -hmm. Just a moment. Next, multiply this uh, uh, the equation through by negative 3. All the terms should be multiplied by this. So we should start with z prime, right? Wait, just a moment. Mm -hmm, um, mm -hmm. This is y prime, y times y. Right, prime. and, it, uh, and mm -hmm. if you multiply this by negative 3, if you multiply this equation... Ah, we may start with the multiplication of this, multi yes, uh, this equation. Three. But now, so if we don't want to rewrite... Then we have this equation. Then so multiply by negative three and mm -hmm, and continue. So uh, okay, uh, of course, so follow is absolutely right uh, to multiply the original equation by negative three. 
and then uh, we would avoid some troubles with these coefficients, right? Mm -hmm. Right, so this is the integrating, so mm, minus, I think, minus 3 quart x yeah, so negative. Mm -hmm. Then integrate it, mm -hmm. yeah. right, mm -hmm. dx, dx, do not forget dx, aha, uh -huh. then how to integrate? One over, this is 1 over 10, uh, which is uh, lean. Uh -huh. Sec square. Uh, not um, so called so over sine. So it should be lin, uh, lin, lin, right? Lin, lin of sine x, I think. Sine x, mm -hmm. because. Mm -hmm. But uh -huh. But how to obtain this formula? Do you know how I was to integrate? Of substituting. Uh huh. Nice. And do you know how to integrate this? So if I can use equal to tan x. Uh huh. Then. Is equal to. I think this substitution doesn't work. Hmm. But the the correct. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. The correct answer is the following. So how to integrate quad? So I will use this uh, this part of the blackboard. So if we want to integrate quad x, what shall we do? We should represent cot x as the ratio cos x over sin x dx and make a substitution u equals sin x. Mm -hmm. Then du will be cos x dx. Then using this substitution we will have the following du over u. And this is a ln absolute value of u plus c and so it's a ln sin x plus c okay. as required uh-huh uh, right mm-hmm oh, nice mm-hmm cubed mm-hmm correct Okay, but uh, we may use any of these two functions. There are two functions, uh, sine x or minus sine x, but we can choose any. We need just one function, not all the functions or many functions. Mm -hmm. And we can choose sine x without absolute value. Okay. So let it be u of x, let it be 1 or sine cubed. Sine cubed x. Mm -hmm. Right. Back mm -hmm, into mm -hmm. this equation. Mm -hmm, right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Prime, mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then integral, so this is the basic, basic integral. It can be taken from the table of integration. This is the basic integration formula. Mm -hmm. one Minus 1 over sine squared x is a derivative of cot x, right? So mm, the derivative of cot x is minus 1 over sine squared x. 
without minus. So because the derivative of cot yeah. is minus one over sine. So it, it will be three cot cot x. Mm hmm mm hmm right. Then uh, so one of the But I think first solve for z and then Oh, let's let's move sine cubed x uh, to the right hand side. Mm -hmm. So let it be <laughs> three. If we multiply it by sine, it will be so cot times sine will sine cube uh, sine squared, right? Sine squared, right? Sine squared times cos. Mm -hmm. Sine squared x cos x, right? Mm -hmm. Times c. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Can I leave it like this? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, right. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> okay, and now uh, is it time to move on to the Riccati equation? Are you ready for Riccati equation? So first, uh, the first step will be to find a particular solution. Then, using this particular solution to uh, to reduce our mm, to convert our equation to a Bernoulli equation, and after this, complete these steps. <laughs> right, let's, let's try. So it's important to be able to solve a Riccati equation. Mm -hmm. Let's try Riccati equation. Uh, it was task number two. So task number three. Let it be x cubed y prime plus x squared y minus y squared equals two x to four. Mm -hmm. Right. So this is a Riccati equation. And now let's try to guess the, the form of a particular solution. Okay, so to find a particular solution, to guess a particular solution, you should try to find a function um, so that all the terms uh, be similar. So similar functions, right? So look at this. So it is 2x to 4. Which function will give us uh, terms that look like uh, x to 4? x squared, right. So c times x squared. And the constant c should be found uh, from the equation. Right. Okay. Kathy, are you ready? <laughs> Will you try? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here is the chalk. Mm -hmm. So I try, like try, try, right? Mm -hmm. I manipulate. <laughs> right. How I like to see it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm 
C times x squared is okay, I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. Uh huh. To uh, to see x, right? To see uh, no no no. So, ah, uh, it should be y, not y prime. So it oh, should be yeah. c x squared. But I think uh, it's better to use the original equation. It's more easy, I think, okay. for this. So uh, for this substitution, let's let's use the original okay. equation. Mm -hmm. Not divided. Not divided by x squared. It's more convenient, of course. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. Right. C squared. Uh -huh. Ah, right. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Right, correct. Mm -hmm. What is this? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. C squared, correct. Goes to. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. So. Mm hmm mm hmm Well, see uh huh. Mm hmm And you may choose uh any value you want. Mm hmm One or two. I think one <laughs> one is more convenient, right? So the first step is complete completed. Uh huh. Let it be so use this space. Mm hmm and the result of the first step is a particular solution given in the form y1 equals x squared. After this, we will use a particular solution to find a general solution for the original equation. Use this part of the blackboard. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Substitute will get cancelled anyway. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why? R all right. Uh huh. Uh And now you may use functions a, b, and c taken from our equation. So right? For our equation, we have 
be there um, minus uh, e plus Mm -hmm. right. so, uh -huh. mm -hmm. so I know y1 uh, y1 is equal to x square right I mean, and where is my a? minus uh-huh this is a a is equal to minus one uh-huh this is b right mm -hmm. this is c where did c disappear uh-huh <laughs> uh uh-huh so c disappear right to be y so it is a uh hard -huh, and pride mm -hmm, next squared mm -hmm. b y v is <laughs> one uh -huh. uh, y x cubed mm -hmm. b is uh, is it cubed uh, or, so, ah, it's it's cubed. Uh -huh. okay. I see, I see, right. So, mm -hmm. this is equal to b dash mm -hmm. minus um, 1 over x. Mm -hmm. u uh, is equal to 1 over x cubed. Mm -hmm. u squared. Okay. Now... Mm -hmm. So I just check ah plus two so minus one over x right I see mm -hmm. so this is a Bernoulli equation yes. and now we should make a substitution mm -hmm. Z. <laughs> mm -hmm, Z. Z is equal to, let's say, minus 1 over oh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. like Let it be minus, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You, you... Uh -huh. Ah, do d dx dz over dx. Uh, <laughs> so z and u are both functions on uh, depending on x, mm -hmm. and so you differentiate with respect to x, not u. Yes. So it should be dx. Mm -hmm. uh, wait. Du by du mm -hmm. by dx. Mm -hmm. Not not two. <laughs> uh -huh. Right. Do I mm -hmm. see it should be a yes? Mm hmm So this is uh, uh -huh. this is right. Mm-hmm. Z mm-hmm over X right. Mm-hmm. Well, Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Boom, we take X. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Now... Mm -hmm. so is one over x squared mm -hmm. ah right mm -hmm. it will be mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then z ah 
Z over X, aha, uh -huh, is equal to this, and so. Mm, I hope Z so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, my. So C can be left uh, in this form. So after relabeling, we may use. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. right, so u is equal to 1 or 1 plus cx, uh-huh, I think, <laughs> so where is the beginning of this task? Oh, u is the general function. Right, mm -hmm. so uh-huh. y is equal to y mm Okay, which solution would we need? Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, and uh, we should add uh, uh, the particular solution y equals x squared, mm -hmm. right? y equals x squared. Uh -huh. So uh, this was a particular oh, yes. solution and it is not included in this, uh -huh, in this formula. But so... Uh, just a moment. <sighs> so here we divided everything divided by. I will check. So U as I think so. That uh, so this is uh, this function doesn't satisfy this equation. <laughs> so there is a problem somewhere. I don't know where, but so let's check this. It seems to me that there is a mistake somewhere. Because if we try with this function, so minus 1 plus cx, let's find the derivative. The derivative is c, so it's c mm -hmm. plus this expression, minus 1 plus cx divided by x. Mm -hmm. So it will be, plus so 2 plus, equals 1 over x cubed. It is not correct. Oh, yes. I, I think that there, uh, so uh, we have mistaken somewhere I don't know just a moment um, what is the integrating factor it is x so it's x so uh, times z not divided by x but nice. z multiplied by x mm -hmm. so, yeah. right mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So next we should divide by x, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh -huh, remove this. So clean, clean this part of the blackboard. So z is equal to mm -hmm. right. Mm -hmm. We may use the common denominator. Uh -huh. I think it's better because uh, next we will invert the. In the fraction right so and then minus y plus. is uh-huh uh-huh right right uh-huh and then the general solution uh-huh y is equal to u plus y1 mm -hmm. and and y1 right yes uh-huh 
right? So u will be equal to x squared mm -hmm, over 1 plus cx, mm -hmm, right? Okay, so you need not do this. I think it's, it's a key. And y equals <laughs> x squared, just x squared. Mm -hmm, yes. Okay, and how to check uh, how to check the solution? So I have noticed uh, the mistake. Mm, uh, uh, okay, for for this reason. So let's let's check the solution. Look at the beginning of our um, of our task. Uh, we have found two particular solutions. Uh, so look here, c can be equal to 1 or 2, right? We have chosen a particular solution for c equals 1, so we have chosen x squared, but another particular solution was 2x squared. And at the end, um, we should be able to obtain this second particular solution, right? For some value of c, we should obtain 2x squared because it's a particular solution, right? And now for x equals 0, we can see that we have 2x squared, right? So this shows that <laughs> it is approximately correct, right? So since we are able to obtain the second particular solution from this general solution, then um, so this gives us a hope that we are correct, right? We get a correct answer. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. Next, um, it's time to... Uh, okay, shall we try another example of the Riccati equation? Or we may exercise with uh, the preceding topics. So, what is your suggestion? Right, so, right, yeah, yeah, I will include this in the control work because, yeah, let's do one more. right, <laughs> <laughs> one more, mm -hmm. let's do this, right, let's try, okay, so follow, it's your turn now, <laughs> and after, after this we will try to, uh -huh. I will try to answer your questions about the whole work. Now the task. You will should start with this task. <laughs> y prime plus six y squared equals one over x squared. Mm -hmm. In the quiz, I was wondering if I answer four questions, <laughs> then it is not possible to ah, obtain one. Right, so subtract so two. negative y2, so, um, ah, so no answer, right, so it will be two, right, mm -hmm. I will improve, a, I see, I see, so. Yeah, answer four mm -hmm. questions, I cannot Right, do right, impossible. you will not try, uh, so, uh-huh. <laughs> you you, uh, you haven't tried the answer to this yes, fourth I I right right I didn't notice this mm -hmm. I will improve mm -hmm. thank you uh huh uh huh. So correct, we should start with this, c over x, then try to solve this. Uh, oh, oh, it's <laughs> not easy, I think. No, just use the quadratic formula. Right, I think the, use the quadratic formula, right. So, uh, so. 
So it should be minus one plus uh -huh. minus uh -huh. minus. Mi minus one equals zero, right? Yeah. It's better. Mm -hmm. It's more convenient. So one plus should be plus twenty four. Ah, mm -hmm. Five over twelve. Uh -huh. So six over twelve or mm -hmm. over uh, minus one over three. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I prefer one half. Okay. One over two. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, so that means why let's take y1 equals to mm -hmm. 1 over 2x mm -hmm. i'll check this so, mm -hmm. so minus plus right mm -hmm. i think it's correct mm -hmm. So looking at uh, we try to sit uh -huh. oh, square. Let me take square, it. Square, right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Six times, uh huh. I know right. Uh huh. Not plus so uh, and and plus uh, two times A B, so one more term. So you should not square only yeah, each yeah. term. So you should add, but not so not remove. It's correct, but you should add one more term. Plus mm -hmm. Two times mm -hmm. two a b root two two a b right. Mm -hmm. U over x mm -hmm. right. Correct. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. Then look at these terms. Too. So three over two x squared minus this. It will be one mm -hmm. over x squared, mm -hmm. and it can be cancelled with. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. The next step. So now it's a Bernoulli equation. And after this, we should make a substitution. N is 2 now. And so Z will be equal to y is U. U, <laughs> not Y. Oh. But now it's you, <laughs> yes. you, uh -huh. uh, one minus n. The, the, uh -huh. One minus n is minus one, yeah, right? Minus, minus one. one to minus one. Mm -hmm. Times u prime. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
then we divide for Bernoulli, then we divide mm -hmm. by, by u squared. By u squared, yes. And do I? Uh huh. Right. Mm -hmm. so and then substitute right. Mm -hmm. Or you may uh, write minus z prime here. So this yeah. is minus. Multiply mm -hmm. by. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Plus. This is uh, z over x. Six z. Minus six. Right. Plus I just uh, change the sign so because there. Ah, it's not mm -hmm, in the. Mm -hmm. Not uh -huh, in the standard the form, form, right? Mm -hmm. And then the integrating factor. To find the integrating factor, a, a of x is minus, right? Then integrate it. Mm-hmm. 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 So, uh, and then the integrating factor will be e so raised to <laughs> t of x. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh, correct. M minus six. Uh, uh huh. Uh huh. Power my. Uh huh. Minus prime. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Minus six. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, minus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. z is equal to 1 over u. Mm -hmm. And then multiply by x. Uh-huh. Right. So find this and find z. 6x. 6, x, six mm -hmm. over 5x. Mm-hmm. Plus uh, c x is over 6. Mm-hmm. I did z then. 1 over u. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And then U. Where was you? <laughs> uh, so first find U, and after this find the the answer. Oh. Invert this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why one is minus uh huh? Why one is one over two x? Mm hmm. Plus this uh huh? Minus six. Mm hmm. Six uh huh uh huh. Right. Mm hmm. Okay. And so comma and the. Uh, particular solution y equals one over mm -hmm, one over two x. Aha! Uh -huh. Now let's try to check. So uh, 
is it any value for uh, of the constant c for which we can obtain the second particular particular solution which is y equals minus one third look here so another particular solution is uh, given for this value of c it is minus one over three x is it possible to obtain this solution for some value for c i think c should be equal to zero because we have x to six in the denominator right so Let's, let's try c equals 0, because I want to check the solution, the answer, right? c equals 0, mm -hmm. then it will be 1 over 2x minus mm -hmm, 5 over 6x. <laughs> uh -huh. I think it's this. My <laughs> uh -huh. 6x, right? It is just what we need. Minus 2 over 6x, it is minus 1 over 3x. So, right. Mm -hmm. I see. So, <laughs> thank you. I hope it's correct. Mm -hmm. Right. All right, the answer. 2x minus. I will write the answer, because I don't know the answer. 6 fifth x plus cx to 6. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay, now it's time to exercise with the other tasks. Do we need the break or not? Break, maybe. Do you need a break? Mm -hmm. well, let's have a break. For five, five minutes break. What are your ideas? Do you want to um, solve something from the homework, or maybe we will uh, we may try uh, we may, may solve some other problems, some other tasks on exact differential equations? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe so. If you need, okay. if you if you have some problems, from from which from 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 uh -huh, seminar number four ten, uh -huh, number ten. Mm -hmm. Let's discuss task number ten from the homework. Mm -hmm. Solve the differential equation. So I will try. All right. Mm -hmm. And first of all, let's check whether it is exact or not. Is it exact or not? Yeah. So dp over dy is equal to, uh, let's differentiate this, it will be 2x times minus y divided by root x squared minus y squared. Mm -hmm. It is minus 2xy over root x squared minus y squared. And dq over the dx will be minus 2y times x over root x squared minus y squared and we can see that they are the same so our equation is exact and we need to find the inter an integrating factor mm -hmm. now step number two let's find the solution the function f of x y 
can be found as the integral of 1 plus 2x uh, root x squared minus y squared dx mm -hmm. and it should be integrated from some value let it be 1 maybe uh, x0 y0 let it be 1 0 let's integrate from 1 to x Mm -hmm. uh, so we will have the following x mm, just let it be maybe let it be t and t mm -hmm. so it will be x minus 1 plus the integral from 1 to x uh, dt times the square root. How to integrate it? And so it should it will be x minus one. So it's not f of x, just uh, first find the this integral and then we will find f of x. Uh-huh. X minus one plus um, t squared minus y squared raised to the power three third over three third. Mm -hmm. From one to x x minus 1 plus 2 third 1 minus y squared so x mm, x squared right minus 2 third 1 minus y squared raised to the power 3 third and next, the second integral will be the integral from uh, from zero to y of the following. So it will be minus two. Mm, let it be s root mm, x is one, so one minus s squared ds so i have substituted one for x uh, uh -huh. and mm, this will be the integral from zero to y of root one minus s squared d one minus s squared it is one minus x squared raised to the power three third over three third from zero to y it will be two third mm, times one minus y squared raised to the power three third minus two third two third just two third. Mm -hmm. Well. And now we should combine these two integrals, uh, find the sum of these two integrals, f of x will be equal to um, x minus 1. Mm, so we needn't know the constants, right? But mm -hmm, I will leave it. Plus 2 third x squared minus y squared to the power 3 third. So minus this term and plus this term, they will be um, cancelled out. Right, so this would and this will be cancelled out, and so minus two third. This is our function, and the answer will be x plus two third x squared minus y squared 
equal uh, to the power 3 third uh, equals con the constant. So because 2 third and 1 are two constants, and we can mm, combine them to form an arbitrary constant C. Mm -hmm. and so that's so we're done. That's all. Are there any uh, other questions? No, right. Mm -hmm. So we have time to solve something from. Mm -hmm. So let's go further. We cut equations and now let's try to solve the equation. Let it be the following. I will use this part of the blackboard. <sighs> oh, yeah, I don't know the number of task. It will be the task number. So one, two, three. So I, I think it's eight, seven, Maybe seven. Mm -hmm. Okay, solve the following differential equation: x squared plus y squared plus x dx plus x y dy equals zero. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try to solve this. Who wants to try? Uh huh. First, first of all, find the functions p of x and q of x and check whether it is. Whoa. So what's the problem? <laughs> Electricity. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh huh, chalk on oh, this one. <laughs> it's better. Yeah. This chalk is not good. Mm -hmm. Dp over dy is 2y. Mm -hmm dq over dx is y. Mm -hmm. So it's not exact, but let's try to find the integrating factor, if it is. Yeah, I think okay. So we should find the difference of this and try to divide by p of x, y or q of x, y. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. p or q, so we may def uh, decide Mm, after this, uh -huh, after. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it depends on x, right? E to the power. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, we All right, we, we need. Uh, uh -huh. All well, right. It's enough. X is enough. So we need no, uh, to know only one integrating fact, only one function for an integrating fact factor, because um, it serves um, only to um, it serves to reduce our original equation to an exact. And so we need not know all the solutions. We need only one function that help us to reduce the original equation to the exact equation. Now it's exact. I hope it's exact. We may try to check this. Uh huh. Okay. So I see that it is exact, right? Uh huh. But to avoid mistakes, I recommend you to check one more time that it is exact. We have used the formulas that guarantee 
<laughs> that the new differential equation is exact, but it's better to check this to avoid, to avoid mistakes. Right, so it's exact, and now mm -hmm. and maybe zero, zero is the best point. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Just zero. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. Well. Mm-hmm. And and what about y x y squared? Oh, mm -hmm. I didn't see this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Half right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you want to solve one more task? So not, not you maybe, but Kathy. Uh -huh. it, was, uh, it will be the last task. Because, uh-huh. Uh, uh. Okay, uh, the next will be this one. y times 2x plus y cubed dx minus x times 2x minus y cubed dy equals 0. Mm -hmm. So 2... Mm -hmm. So first uh, check uh, whether it is exact or not, and then maybe uh, try to find the integrating factor. Well, could we uh, practice a non-separable instance? Um, uh, separable or no, homogeneous, homogeneous, homogeneous. This is not a homogeneous, right, practice. Mm -hmm. Maybe I can try to... Um, I may take a homogeneous from our homework. It's not, not bad, but... Mm -hmm. Did you look up the chart? Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, so I, I, it is here, but it's maybe not not so good, but it's acceptable. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> not very bad. <laughs> so this chalk is worse, so <laughs> you may use it. <laughs> Follow. And what about seminar one? Uh, can we take uh, tasks from the seminar one, uh, from the homework one? Or uh, do you want to solve it? Or maybe is it ready? Or I, 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 don't, <laughs> I don't remember 
maybe you have already submitted the homework one. <laughs> okay, right, so but may, we may... You minus ah. points because I didn't put some particular See, solutions. Right, uh-huh, uh-huh. So, so minus, uh, minus point for, for what? For ah, C should not be equal to zero, uh-huh. <laughs> okay, so maybe we may uh, solve some tasks from here. So it's number six, right? What's the problem? Ah, we have mistaken here. Uh -huh. But it is separable. But what about homogeneous? It's correct. C. Mm -hmm. C is correct. Okay. If I want to get a full point, uh -huh. just because of all these particular solutions, <gasps> right so it's uh, it has um mm -hmm. the particular solution has to complicated form and so it's difficult for you to to use it and so uh, uh, this is to show you that you need to rewrite it in this form and it would be better but mm -hmm. okay so i think what, what should i do so i will get full marks now should i have to rewrite the whole homework again uh <laughs> no i think i think it's okay so i will uh huh. And what about this? It's what is what's the uh, eight B? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe you, you may, may you may try this. Let let's solve this. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it is eight B. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about the integrating factor? You are trying to find. Uh huh. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And then divide two x plus four x over q. So the, the difference, uh, just a moment. For y cubed. So I think it's it's not uh, right. But it seems to me that you have mis uh -huh. yes. you have mistaken. So uh, it's uh, it's. 3y cubed, so it's 4y cubed minus y cubed. It's not oh. zero, they're not oh. cancelled out. It, it will be 3y cubed yes. plus 6x. So plus, you should add here, you should add 3y cubed. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, you are trying to divide by Q, but uh, it's better to divide by P, right? Because if oh, we compare no. this, right, uh, you can see that if you if you would div uh, if you divide by um, by P, mm -hmm. uh, then you would uh, obtain the function depending on y. So uh, the integrating factor um, doesn't depend on x but it depends on y and the formula will be so uh, the formula um, would be similar to this so you should uh, reverse right mm -hmm. so if g depends on y then g prime over g would be equal to uh, 
it nice. should be d q over right d q over d x minus d p over d y. We may use this, right? Divided by p. Yeah, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. Minus like this. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. And so, since we need just one function, g is equal to 1 over, right, mm -hmm, y cubed. Mm -hmm. So, uh, to reduce, to convert this equation to an exact, we need to divide by y cubed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Just x squared divided by y squared. <laughs> Very easy. If we integrate, uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Y squared. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, you lost squared. Mm -hmm. Squared. Oh, yeah. yes. Mm -hmm. Squared plus mm -hmm, XY, correct. Mm -hmm. Plus, oh. and now we may try to guess this constant R of Y. Right? Oh. So the derivative, I think it's zero. <laughs> or maybe not. So, uh, Let me find out. Right. <laughs> uh huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, r prim prime is zero. <laughs> because there are only two terms here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, so x. Right. Uh, the function, uh huh, uh huh, two terms, just two terms. Mm -hmm. Okay, for do you want to solve the task from the homework, or are you tired, or maybe? Okay, right. Uh, well, I I may show I I may solve it. I'm gonna help you. I may do it myself. Well, uh huh. What do you want? If you want, it's okay. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm, use this this chalk. So it's, it's very bad. Mm -hmm. uh, 
x, y, uh -huh. right there, the task x, y times y prime equals y squared plus x squared y prime. This is a homogeneous equation. Um, and to see this, we should divide by, um, divide by what? By x squared. Let's divide this equation through by x squared. Mm -hmm. Y prime. Mm -hmm. yeah, I know. Okay, so what shall we do? Maybe should we... Do you have other classes after this or not? No? Mm -hmm. So I think it's okay. Uh, we will, <laughs> we will uh, finish in five minutes. So I, s I, I know. Uh -huh. uh, okay, so this is a homogeneous because we can see that um, we have the ratio y over x. Mm -hmm. So u will be mm -hmm, y divided by x, oh. right? Mm -hmm. Correct. If you always try to make it y over x. If you always try to make the ratio y over x. Mm, and now substitute this. So uh, what's yes. the problem? So when we see um, an equation, ah. should we try to make the ratio y over x and Check if it's homogeneous, then uh, or it's it is not necessary. Maybe you can see that it is homogeneous from the original equation, but maybe it's better for me. Uh, it's it's better to um, see the ratio y mm -hmm. over x. Okay. Mm -hmm. But it is not necessary, of course. Mm -hmm. Right, correct. Mm -hmm. U. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Apply, apply this uh, plus this. Uh -huh. X, Y prime mm -hmm. plus U, Y prime. Just Y prime. So, uh, or oh, just U, U, uh huh, U prime. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, X. X, U plus uh -huh, U prime, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. And you should substitute uh, this for Y prime. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. U times uh -huh, plus U. Mm -hmm. Then... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. what else? Okay, let's uh, and now the variables have separated. So u x plus u. Uh -huh, so it should be moved to the left. Minus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It should uh, and uh, you should leave so u on here. the right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then separate variables. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's good. Good. Right. Mm -hmm. U. Then divide by x. And mm -hmm. divide by you should you should factor. Uh, right. So uh, mm, you should move the common factor. So okay. u prime is a common factor. It should be moved from there. Let mm -hmm. me write, uh, x. x u prime times u minus one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Equals u. Uh huh. And then separate variables. U prime. Mm -hmm. Now, so you should not. So uh, you should not move. Uh, uh, u minus one should be left on the le uh, on the left hand side, because uh, all the terms with u should be gathered uh, on the left side, and all terms with x will be moved to the right. Okay. Should be moved to the right. So it should be du times u minus 1 divided by u. So du multiplied by u minus 1 and divided by u mm -hmm, equals uh, dx over x. Mm -hmm. And then integrate, so it's very easy, I think, it integrate both parts. Uh, 
Minus one all the ride. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. And after this, uh, let's replace u by y over x. Mm -hmm. Y over x. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Plus C. Mm -hmm. So that's all. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, so that's all. Thank you for your attention. See you later and bye.